guys. Today we are in Ronx, Pennsylvania, standing in front of Hershey Farms Restaurant. Now they have a buffet in here. We've never been to it, we've just eaten here. And this is one of the bigger buffets in this area. Another nice thing about this restaurant, is right next to the Sight and Sound. Yeah, so they bring buses and everything in here, but today we got lucky. The Sight and Sound show's going on. There's nobody here. So we're about ready to head in and check it out. Are you ready, Bobby? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. Weekday, $20.99 for lunch, $27.99 for dinner. The weekend it goes up to $31.99 for dinner and $27.99. Weekend on Sunday is $27.99. You got this grill back there. They'll make all that for you in the back there. Let's do the breakfast smorgasbord. Now, drinks are not included with either one. The brand smorgasbord or the breakfast. But breakfast is $15.99. If you want to go to a, a lighter option, you have a soup salad, gourmet bread, and potato bar for $13.99 for lunch, $14.99 for dinner. And there's your unlimited hot and cold beverages. Okay, that is it. Okay, let's look at the soups. Cream of broccoli. Cream of broccoli. Vegetable bean. They're hot in there. There's potato. That one smells really good. And then you have some chili. Okay, what's in here? Baked potatoes. Baked potatoes. Lots of little baked potatoes. That's nice, isn't it? Broccoli, some cheese, bacon. Yeah. Says it's bacon dressing back there. Nachos. There's your salad. Let's take a look at the salads. Now we just walked in, so it's just now open, really, about 10 minutes ago. That looks nice. There's some ham salad in there. Coleslaw, beets, cottage cheese, apple butter, bacon bits and croutons. That's a nice little salad bar. You know, I want to tell you why this is probably on the salad bar. When we did that Amish farm, they said the Amish people eat cottage cheese and the apple oh, butter together good. where we put it on bread. I know, it doesn't sound good to me. All right, Bobby. Glazed carrots and sweet potato casserole. And we'll get some of that. and cheese, stewed tomatoes. Macaroni and cheese looks good. Mm -hmm. Stewed tomatoes, I will pass on. And I have baked beans. And there's the noodles. Your famous noodles. I like how they do this with the stations. Green beans and corn. Chicken pot pie. That's going to look like chicken noodle soup. Yeah. That's what it looks like up here. Always like that up here. It's always good. And mashed potatoes made from scratch. Rice. Chicken au gratin. Rice. Beef stir fry. Looks good. Try some of that. I might. 
It says locally grown cabbage with brown butter. Fried chicken. Yeah, fried chicken. That's their specialty here. Well, I opened that. That really smells good. It does smell good. You can smell it. Before I forget, let's go over here and get these in these corners. There's something in that one corner I have to get. They have uh, different kinds of breads. Raisin bread, honey wheat bread, and just white bread. Country butter, maple butter, bread icing. Corn nuggets, corn French nuggets. Fries, and chicken nuggets. What did I miss back here in this corner? There we go. Now so that probably looks where you'll good. Spend most of your time. I just wonder if I can just take that to the table. I think they would be mad. I think some people would be upset. Gravy, chicken gravy, and then Amish filling, which we call stuffing. Yeah, they call it Amish filling and what? Bread? Bread filling or something, I think is what it was. Okay, let's go up to the this one. Up here, let's get this one up here first. I don't want to miss everything. Pork and sauerkraut and handballs. Boy, the handballs are going fast. They are. I'm definitely going to have to get some of those guys. Roast beef. Roast beef. Well, that looks good. Mm -hmm. Fried shrimp. Is it nice and crispy? Baked pollock. Oh yeah. So, isn't this nice again though how they do this? It keeps it, it all warm in these silver containers. Have pizza and ham. And they have this grill. I think you can get all this on it. Too much to choose from here. Let's go down here and see what we have. It's a Dessert station, ice cream. Kinds of stuff, toppings. Yeah, plenty of toppings. Looks like they carry strawberry ice cream, but it's temporary out of order. You can make a waffle. Uh oh, there's some pies back here. Look at all those desserts in the back. Apple pies. Cake. It's nice how small they are. That way, if you wanted to try two different ones. Are you going to get you a shoe fly pie tonight? I don't think. Let's go up on top. Let's do this top. Cherry pie, peach pie. Oh, blueberry. Look at that green thing right there. I don't know what that is. Bakery yeah. Try the white cake. White cake. And it says Hershey Farms Famous. Chocolate cake. We have some jellos down here, and some rice, and some fruit. And I almost missed something back here in this back corner. That pretzels. Look this at is that. nice, isn't it? It is. But you know what I've seen happen to one of those before at one time? I saw a kid stick his finger in one of those. Cookies. And this place is famous for their whoopie pies. We attended the whoopie pie festival up there, didn't we? Yeah, there was a lot of Love to come back to that. So that's a pretty good sized buffet. So we're going to get us something to eat and we'll come back and show you some of it. First round up there. Here's what we got. Had to get some shrimp. Couldn't pass up that ham either. Wanted to, but I couldn't pass it up. Bobby, what'd you get? Some sweet potatoes, glazed carrots. That's the stir fried. Fried chicken, which they're famous for. And pork and sauerkraut. All right. Now, since we didn't have this for New Year's, which you're supposed to eat for good luck, we didn't. I'm gonna have some now. Okay. Let me get a piece of meat there. Sauerkraut's good. Meat's tender. Now I know you're not a fan of the sauerkraut. No, I'm not gonna have me try that. Here's the um, stir fry. Stir fry. 
Everything looked good up there, didn't it? It did. You see how hot it was? Yeah. Vegetables are good. Done well, soft. Nice, pretty good sized piece of meat in mm -hmm. there. No peas and broccoli. You like sweet potatoes. Mm -hmm. Love sweet potatoes. Good with the marshmallows. I don't usually make it with the marshmallows, but I like it like that. And then there's the yep, chicken. They're famous for that. Now that's when they we have used a lot to, of chicken. Right there. We used to come in here and get the chicken dinners. Mm -hmm. We didn't get the buffet. I wanted to get a small piece just because yeah, there's want to too many other things to try. It's tender. Good. Okay. Where am I going to start? You know what? I'm going to start at these shrimp. Crispy shrimp. I like to add some seafood up there. That was nice. Mm -hmm. Tastes good. They're not overly crisp. I mean, they're they're frozen. You can tell they're not. Yeah. Fresh, fresh, right out of the ocean. But they're they're good. Got good flavor to them. I'm gonna try these ham balls, which are really popular in Amish country. This is ground beef and ham mixed together as a meatball. Those are melt in your mouth. And got that pineapple glaze on it. Gives that sweet taste. So if you guys have never tried that, you need to try that sometime. That is so good. Ready to get the noodles. Famous noodles. Mm -hmm. Now I'll say they're not overly hot. They taste good, but they're not hot like that one place we were at the other day. Everything was really hot. That one, everything else was hot, but mm -hmm. not the noodles. You can pick this up. This is some flaky. That's what I was trying to do. Trying to um, stir it up so yeah. that it. Well, we just came it's in off of their lunch menu. So, fish. I probably like cod better, but that's uh, Pollock. Here's their ham. They cut me. I told them a small piece because I got to try everything up there. So, see, I can cut that. Look at it. Cuts that. Yeah. That was just really cut right off that carbon station. So that looked excellent. Has some fat on it. I don't care. Now that ham has a great flavor to it. Is that brown sugar on mm -hmm. top? You can taste that. And shrimp. Shrimp, shrimp. Yeah, plenty of it. That's what I'm gonna be eating a lot of. <laughs> Glad it's on the buffet. I normally get a lot of chicken, but tonight we'll get a lot of shrimp. Let's just eat it without any sauce. That's good shrimp, nice and cold. So I'm happy with the first round. Hey, Bobby. How do you doing, there you go. Now you push that completely underneath there. Yeah. That's what I did. There you go. That looks good. Hey guys, we've got some dessert. We have the Hershey Farms famous chocolate cake. Blu-ray pie. Chocolate marshmallows and pineapple. And white. Yeah, I figured if I got chocolate marshmallows, I'd get a white cake. Moist cake, I like the icing on there. It's light, it's not real thick. Icing. It's That's about it. the right size cake, so you can Plenty. get more or something. Mm -hmm. yep. There we go. There's the marshmallow. I'm surprised they didn't have strawberries up there. That would have been now. Not a good season for strawberries yet, uh -huh. maybe. With some rich chocolate. But it's good, so I'm glad I didn't get a chocolate cake. All right, here we go. See something missing on there? I do, and I can't believe you didn't get the shoe fly pie. Well, I got these two because this place is famous not for their shoe fly pie, but for their whoopie pies. So I'm hoping to get some of that too. So let's try the famous chocolate cake. And that's thin, so there's not a lot there to fill. Yeah. Up. That's moist. It's got a great chocolate mm -hmm. flavor to it. Love the icing. Yeah, the icing's not real thick, is it? No, it's down here. It's real nice. We haven't had to wait for anything. No, that. very friendly. Right there's all the icing on it. It's mm -hmm. not abundance of icing on there, but it tastes good. And what did you get there? I got blueberry. I like blueberry pie. You don't usually see that. That's why I tried it. Just because something I haven't had for a while. It's real. The filling, the mm -hmm. pie filling, whatever they're using, the blueberries. It's really thick, the topping. So, it's excellent also. So I gotta save room for that whoopie pie. I'm gonna try. At least eat half of one. Or even a bite of one. Or a bite, I have to. Look down, I got it, guys. 
Nice look. Creamy icing or frosting in the center. Oh, chocolatey goodness all over my fingers already. Here we go. Does it look good, Bob? It does. Probably, it's just two big old hunks of cake. There's tons of cream in there. And it's called Whoopie Pie. Do you know why it's called Whoopie Pie? Why? Because they were so good back in the day, they went, hey. that's That's the reason. Now, but, I bought the cake pan up here to make that Pacific way that they do that, to make that cake. There's a festival, I think we mentioned it earlier, but they have just so many different varieties. These come in September, and they had the world's largest whoopie pie. Hopefully, if they have it this year, if we're able, we'll come up there and bring that to you. I have to maybe put a picture from when we came up of yeah, us staying by the world's long, largest yeah. whoopie pie. That thing melted because it was like, what, 80 degrees out It there. was. And you shoot whoopie pies up through the field, so it's... Whoopie pie, is, checkers, yeah, and everything. Yeah, it's a great time to come here. Here's the bill at Hershey Farm Restaurant and Inn. Buffets are $27.99, and you see that discount. Those came off of our phone online. So just look up Hershey Farms, and it'll say coupon. You can save yourself two buffets, $4. Bobby's drink, $2.99. Grand total of $58.27. So inside this restaurant's a huge gift shop. We're not going to go over the whole thing, but I'm going to show you something that I like. Whoopie pies. So if you come here, you need to take some of these home. They have them packed up. You can take six of them home, or you can buy them individually for $275. There's some red velvet ones. Some other desserts. Apple streusel, some banana bread, cranberry, cherry streusel, some pull-aparts, turnovers, some sticky buns with nuts, and shoe fly pie. And it's other pies over here. That blueberry, I had that tonight. It was good. Cherry. Well, guys, we just left Hershey Farm, so we decided to end it right in front of Amos. What did you think about it, Bobby? We got here as soon as they switched over from lunch to dinner. So when we first got in there, there wasn't hardly anybody in there. I think there was two people that went yeah. in before us, so we got there at a great time. Uh, but by the time we left, it's starting to get crowded. I thought the food was good. Um, I really like that fried chicken. I like that sauerkraut with the pork. That was really good. The cake, I like the because it was white and it was a light icing. It wasn't real thick and heavy. Now for me, it was twenty seven dollars. Yeah, twenty seven. You got a two dollar coupon. For me, I can't eat that much um, at one time. Me, I like to eat a little bit all day long. So. I wish they would do a regular menu, which they're not doing right now. Now, if they used to, maybe they'll go back. Yeah, maybe. It's not even in the uh, menu anymore. It used to be you had a menu, then yeah. you had the buffet. And that's where we would come. We would come here and just get the chicken dinners and stuff. But if you can eat a lot at one time, I thought it was pretty good. They had a different variety of stuff to they eat. Did. I liked how they kept it. I think we said that earlier. Like how everything was just shut, kept it yeah. uh, nice and hot. Yeah. Everything was good. I love The ham was probably my favorite, but... Ate a lot of shrimp in there, yeah. guys. Now, I didn't get any chicken. I ate a little piece of Bobby's. And we didn't show you everything we ate. We figured you guys don't want to see every single thing. But whoopie pie was good. Had nice desserts. They did. Like to try the ice cream. and just had no room. Now, what Bobby said, $27.99 is worth that. I probably didn't even eat $27.99 worth of food. But you're in Amish country. You're at a, a, one of the bigger buffets. There's cheaper buffets than this. But... The quality of the food was good. I mean, it yeah, was it was, good it was it food. was good. And if you stay here, we heard somebody say, stay here at Hershey. What twenty percent off? Twenty percent. So that would have saved us uh, ten or twelve bucks. Yeah, and our waitress Sylvia, she did a great mm. job. Yeah, we never had to ask her for anything. We yeah. went up there and we came back, and our uh, all our drinks were filled. We didn't yeah. ask her to do it. And they had a couple um, gentlemen picking up the plates. As soon as we put one to the side, they were right there. Yeah, they were just walking around. It up. So it was a good experience. It was. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Yeah, so until we meet again, J&B have left the building. <laughs>